Well, most of you guys use apps from the Play Store. Did you know that there are some apps which are really beneficial but banned from the Play Store? What's up guys, this is Carlton here. In this video, I'm going to be telling you about 10 banned apps on the Play Store. With that being said, let's get started. Here we go. So the first app is called Showbox. This app allows you to download latest movies and TV shows for free. The movies and shows are updated every week and the user interface is pretty smooth and easy to use. In addition to movies and shows, it also gives you the latest trailers and news about the happenings of upcoming movies and shows. So to download a movie or a TV show, all you need is in this case to select the movie which you want and then select the resolution and hit download. It is as simple as that. So moving on to the next app, this app is called Terrarium TV which allows you to download movies and TV shows for free on your Android phone. It is almost similar to Showbox. As you can see, you can select different categories from the latest movies to the most trending and so on. To download, we select the movie which we want. One thing about this app is it gives you an overview of the movie that is shows you the trailer and tells you what the movie is about. So select the resolution and then hit download. So this app is called OG Insta which is a modded Instagram app. It has the same user interface as the original. The only difference is that you can download any pictures and videos from Instagram directly to your Android phone. So if you want any paid apps and games for free, this is the app to install. This app is called AC Market. It has almost the same user interface as Google Play Store. This game is called Bully which costs about 420 bucks on the Play Store. And here you get it for free. It also includes copies of the latest to the oldest versions of the game and also includes modded versions of some games and apps. So this app is very useful for those hardcore Android gamers out there who want all the best games but good but after all good games come at a price. So you guys might be thinking this app is from Xiaomi but it isn't. It's from an independent developer. As the name suggests, it's a file explorer and it allows you to browse your files with ease. As you can see, all, all your type of files is categorized and easy to find. One of the best features is that you get an inbuilt music player and a video player with the app which allows you to play music and videos from within the app itself. You can also change the theme, skins and languages which is not available in most of the file explorers out there. So altogether this is a multi-functional app and has also a root access feature for rooted phones. So guys this is Fildo and this app allows you to download your favorite and the latest music for free. You can also search for albums as well as individual songs. It also gives you the latest albums displayed over here. So all you need to do is type the name of the song, select the song and just hit download. Just like AC Market, this is another app which allows you to download and update paid and banned apps from the Play Store for free. This app is called Up to Down. Most of the apps in this video can be downloaded from this app store and you get almost all the banned apps here for free. So moving on, this app is called Mobro which allows you to stream different international television channels for free. As you can see, it has different categories like sports and music and a lot more. So while we are here, let's click on Cartoon Network. It streams pretty quickly and is pretty responsive. This app is called OG YouTube. This is the modded version of the YouTube app which provides great features that we don't get in the official app. In addition to watching YouTube videos, it also allows you to download them in the resolution in which the video is available. So all we need to do is search for the video we want to download, tap the download icon, select the resolution of your choice. You can also change the title of the video while downloading and then hit download. You can also play the video in the background and if you want to watch the video while using other apps, you can hit the pop-up icon and enjoy your video. 
For this app to work, you will have to install an additional app called MicroG, which is linked down in the description. So moving on to the last app, this app is called Popcorn Time. Just like Showbox and Terrarium TV, this is another movie and TV show downloader. So only difference between Showbox, Terrarium TV and Popcorn Time is that in addition to streaming and downloading movies and TV shows, we can also download and stream anime which most of you guys might be loving. If you guys like this video, don't forget to smash the like button and hey, if you're new here, consider subscribing. So I want to hear from you guys which one of these apps is your favorite and please do mention it in the comment section down below. With that being said, thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.